and her in Leche. And we are in the car because we don't know where to go. Charat. <laughs> no, no but we we're going it, to buy the we find it here. Um, olive oil. Use... Lo how do you call it? My local farm, right? It's a local farm, yeah, for local production. Local farm a... for local production. Hindi siya yung export quality. Found it with the way? Si. We okay, found we it. found the way. This is the way, the Google Maps. And let's go. Way to go. Yun na yun siya. See you there. I'll show you there. Loob ng shop mamaya. But for now, hanapin muna na natin yung tamang address. Anyway, today is Saturday. This is the road where we're going. Ang aga aga yan ng ano, ng ibon. Hindi ko pa siya nalinisan. Hindi pala ako maglilinis. Yung car wash pala maglilinis. <laughs> Let's go. Ito po ang aking hacienda, Charot. We are arriving at Tenuta Verola in Carmiano. It's just uh, 15 minutes outside of Lecce downtown. And it's a typical Masseria del Salento. That means typical farmhouse. Uh, main production is uh, wine, oil, fruit, and vegetables. Johnny Dutti, how are you? Yeah. Salve, <laughs> yeah. yeah. oh, buongiorno. <laughs> Uh, we are all in. This is some buka, no? So, okay, we got our four liters of oil, and how much did we pay? 40. 10, 40 euro, euro. 10, euro, 10 euro per liter. And he told me that it's doubled then a few years ago because of the less production because of so many trees. Uh, so the one that we bought is Sambuca, right? Or no, the, the one we bought is a uh, grapes uh, liquor uh, similar to rum. The base is uh, are the grapes, the wines. So it's, oh, it's pretty cheap also, right? 27? I don't like this in uh, in Hong Kong. Karina, I need to go to do. I need to know what I left. A uh, right rather. Artesan, artesano. This one. No, Louisiana favorito. So this one. See. Okay. Concentrate muna tayo sa pagmaneho. Sabi ni sir. Okay, 2K on this road. Stop for a coffee somewhere. I would like to stop for a cappuccino. In a place like this one no. is uh, what's the name of the olive tree? Lecina. Uh, because no. this one is uh, powerful against the xylella. Ah. Okay. So what did you say about the extra virgin olive oil? The, the oil is born. Uh, like extra virgin olive oil but within 12 months uh, it decays by itself into virgin oil because it's losing acidity because of the chemical reaction that the oil has uh, when we went out we have to go this way not the other way. See. okay we have just reached copertino and we are now on the hunt of Go, Amore, it's free. Cappuccino. Cappuccino, cappuccino, cappuccino. Cappuccino in copertino. Cappuccino in copertino. But looks like everything is closed. Now check out. Copertino is the birthplace of one of the most famous Italian rock band. And the name of this rock band is Negro Amaro. Exactly like the name of the wine, because it's the name of the wine of this region, so they got this name. Negro Amaro Rock Band is very famous in Italy and it's coming from Copertino. Do not hesitate, go on YouTube and play Negro Amaro and enjoy it. <laughs> okay, we have just paid our parking for one euro. It's from now until 4.30 p.m. The place where we stayed, actually the location where we stayed is in Lecce. It's, um, 60 cents per hour so 
outside the historical area is mas ano siya, mas mura. So okay now let's go for cappuccino. Now our lovely Karina, she's enjoying uh, her first cappuccino of the day together with the chocolate cornetto. And uh, gorgeous husband, uh, that means myself. I'm enjoying uh, a quinotto. And we are in one of the coffee bars in the central area of Copertino that as you know already from the previous video is the birthplace of the Negramaro rock band. Yeah. Salento in my blood. How much was our breakfast? What you left? 55 Hong Kong dollars. 55 Hong Kong dollars? One cappuccino. One quinotto. One cappuccino, one quinotto and one sandwich. One sandwich, a very good one and spicy. And a croissant with chocolate. And a croissant with chocolate. That's all cost. 55 Hong Kong dollars. Okay, let's go to Nardos now. And it's traffic now. is the old city hall of Nardo. Well, we are having the summer drink of leche. It's called uh, no, the name was Cafe Giacchio con Latte Mandorla. Mandorla is almond, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Coffee with ice and almond milk. This one is the oldest restaurant, right? Or oldest cafeteria? What can you hold this one? I'm gonna go si. back and then. See, si, grazie. You come out from here. Is a video? Now, okay. Dito po tayo hot lunch. Kaya lang, medyo, medyo konti na lang yung power po. Pagod na. Why don't we have pepper? Now what are we having here, Amore? We have having meatballs, mm -hmm. potato croquette, and this one deep fried vegetables as well. Thank you. Bye, buon appetit. Grazie. This kind of pasta. Oh, this is crispy pasta. It's very hot. This is deep fried pasta. This one. Then the rest is a kind of pasta named Tria mm -hmm. with the chickpeas sauce. That's right. Chickpeas and olive oil, nothing pasta more than that. Farming food. Mm -hmm. Or a cat with uh, eggplant, cacio ricotta salato, that is a cheese, and tomato sauce. Okay, buon appetit. So this one is with chickpeas. Chickpeas. Olive oil and tuya. Olive oil and tuya. Okay, let's swap the, <laughs> swap the pasta. Okay, this one is with eggplant. This is orecchia. Eggplant, cacio ricotta, salata and tomato. Buon appetit. Molto buono. Yeah. Yeah. Hindi siya masarap. How much is it in Hong Kong? Four seventy. Four seventy Hong Kong. Okay, let's do this. Here is your. Uh. Girone dei Golosi in the historical center of Nardo, where we have a fantastic uh, orecchiette and the tria with chicory and uh, a sparkling wine called the Sudest, Southeast. That is exactly the geographic location of Salento, the southeast of Italy, the hills of Italy. Why? 
Nardus is very famous because it's uh, one of the most ancient uh, uh, human uh, settling uh, in southeast uh, Italy. We are talking about the Paleolithic scene, scene, Paleolithic scene. So, and the city of Nardus has been founded by the Mesapic people, they are the original people living in Puglia, 700 years before Christ, and then passed through all the Roman uh, uh, Empire and the other civilization that they were present in Italy for 2000 years. Okay, Miss Karin. Now we go back to our Bentley and we draw back to the historical center in Lecce because we are so sleepy after the tree. And <laughs> show me your sleepy face, Miss Karin. Okay, lunch is finished, now we're going back to Lecce. We go back to Lecce, Mark, right? Sì. And it's how many kilometers from here? 30. It's 30 kilometers from okay. here. And today is... 35 degrees. Like... Nung umalis ako ng Hong Kong, medyo lighter yung skin ko. Now, mas maitim pa ako sa mga puno. But it's okay. Dark and shining. Gold pala yung kulay. Bronze, bronze color pala siya instead. Now, most of the shops here are closed. Dahil, siesta, and they will reopen around 6 p.m. After siesta, 6 p.m., correct? Yeah. See, they will reopen 6 p.m. And this is our Bentley char. <laughs> Bentley char. <laughs> oh, it's hot. Bye, Nardo. Go that way, but uh, okay. We have reached in Lecce. I have to correct myself, it was not 30k, it was only 23k. And like what I've said earlier, it's siesta that's why yan. nobody around. So, lot of people are going to be after 5 30. That's the, the thing, that's the Pumo Lecce. Pumo Lecce. See. See, the other road will come out there. So yun lang siya. I'll show you. Wala talaga yung tao. Kasi nga, ayan. Siesta. Pauwi pa lang kami. Magsisiesta. Char. Matutulog yung antok. Ayan. And this one here is a boteco. Boteco. Boutique hotel. Ayan siya. The place where we're staying is Airbnb. Pareho lang naman. Yung Airbnb pala walang ano, walang service. Yan may service, pero that's okay. Okay. We are very close home. Like here we are. Closing, closing. We are number of Bonjoro. Number here. This is our temporary home. And we are, you know, it's okay. Number five. This is the Bulak. Of course. Siesta. Now we're going for dinner. Are we gonna have horse meat? And what are you having? Next? What would you like to have for dinner? I don't know because actually I'm not hungry at all. To be honest. Me, I'm hungry, so we're gonna have horse we meat, some and wine, see. and yung siesta ay natapos ng alas ocho. So alas tres hanggang alas ocho. I think it's no longer it's, uh, siesta. Eight uh, fifteen. Now. Eight, eight fifteen. 15. Okay, then let's go Goodbye. find a horse meat. <laughs> Wala masyadong tao kasi Max Diyan po tayo kakain So I think I'm gonna have Nawala ito Cavallo al sugo So horse meat In tomato sauce And red wine That's my dinner so I'm having red wine tonight for a change. Cantelo de Gramado. It's not the Teresa Manara, but it's the Gramado Cantelo. Oh, it's a good one. Sai che non l'abbiamo ancora visto. 
what are we having? Different kind of cheese? Different kind of fresh cheese, uh, walnut, rucola and honey. This is tagliere piccolo with everything. Oh my god, this is my favorite filino. All the good stuff. Okay, the second dish is horse, horse, horse meat stew. See, horse meat stew with uh, tomato sauce. Okay, show me how you eat it with the bread. Yeah, with the bread because of the tomato sauce and. Uh, but I actually would like to have it to the rice. No, don't do that because that does not belong. Uh, okay, they said don't do that, otherwise they will. No, they do not belong. I mean, uh, it, there is no tradition for that. There's no tradition for horse meat and rice. Know what is that. Okay, whatever. But they have a burger steak with rice. How do you? How is it? Good. Simply good. Okay, let's enjoy.